Hey everyone, good afternoon. It is 12.33 on the Eastern Seaboard and here in Trinidad and lovely Tobago. And I am glad to be joining you today. For those of you who don't know me, I am Hillary DeFreitas. I'm the marketing mom. I'm the social media. I am a social media manager, digital marketing expert over at Elite Marketing Pro. Um, and I am also a business coach, an online business coach and trainer. And why am I here? Because I love to teach moms and particular well, I work particularly with moms, but anybody who really wants to learn how to use digital marketing online marketing and the principles of attraction marketing and that's exactly what we're going to be talking about today but for just a short bill recap for those who don't know me i mean i know my facebook fans you've been following me for quite some time now um and you know often when i think about this whole online marketing journey i think about you know four years ago and i have my daughter to thank for that you know four years ago my first daughter when you know we found out we were pregnant with her and you know I'm going off on my maternity leave and I said to myself I'm not going back I'm not going back because I watched so many moms inside of our office space literally suffer in a sense because they were moms they had to ask permission to go and see their children ask permission to go if they were still breastfeeding ask permission to leave work to go home to breastfeed or to go and pump you know because our situation you know it's not exactly the prettiest for pumping in the office we don't have dedicated rooms and those type of things and I really thought to myself, I don't want to go through that as a mother in the workplace. I want to have the freedom to be able to do what I want to do, when I want to do it, how I want to do it. So now, four years later, I'm able to drop my girls off to, to preschool now because they're at that age and they'll actually be going into primary school next year, which is just amazing. I'm able to do my have my morning routine, come back, work my three hours in the morning, then take a re take a rest and work another two hours in the afternoon. And I do have that flexibility and freedom. I don't have to be tied on. I don't have to ask a boss, hey boss, I need to go and pick up my kids, or I need to go and drop this, you know, whatever the case may be. So that is, you know, that has been what the online marketing journey and experience has been for me. And one of the things I'm going to be talking about that today is the content that I've been able to put out over the last four years, and particularly because of attraction marketing. Now, I've shared with you before, you know, the attraction marketing formula. Now, this book, actually, this book, if you were to click on the link in the description um, above or below, um, HillaryDeFreitas.com forward slash AMF is actually going to lead you to what we call a 10-day boot camp and it's going to give you certain principles of attraction marketing that you just need to have. It's kind of like the beginning, the mindset, fundamentals of what you need to be doing every day to build out what we call an attraction marketing funnel. And the thing that I'm talking about today is very critical in that, which you only see the true picture of when you actually purchase the book, all right? So the book is only $27 if you buy it within an hour. Um, it's 47 other than that, 47 US, all right? But it's really, I mean, this is like the Bible of online marketing in terms of you getting attracting leads because if you're fed up of having to phone people and call people and what you're really interested in is actually getting people to come to you all right what is important there is if you want people coming to you then you have to be doing something putting something out for them to come to you all right and that is what we're going to talk about today which is your content you can know and understand everything about attraction marketing and this is something that we share inside of us in our private community um, with the, uh, what is it, um, inside of our private community, many of you may have seen the movie The Secret, all right? And a lot of people come out feeling very motivated and uplifted in the secret thinking, I just have to think about it and it's going to come to me, I just have to think about it. And that is true to a certain extent because we teach our children that, our four-year-old, actually this morning, you know, there was something that she had on her mind and we literally replaced that bad thought with a positive thought for her so that she would be able to start thinking about that all right so thought is very powerful and one of the things that you need to always have in your, the back of your mind is the thought of what you're gaining all right of what you want to achieve so if you want to achieve new leads for your business new customers new prospects you've got to be thinking that way all right but then your content also has to be 
in such a way that it's going to bring people to you it's going to attract people to you so you have to speak your customers language and why is this important and why is it basically what I consider all right you can have the capture page you can have the perfect capture page you can have the perfect headline but what really attracts them to you is your content and I want to share something that was actually an eye-opener for me that content a lot of people when I first started content to me was a blog post it was a video all right it was some long literary piece of I don't know creation all right I would call this content all right this is a book I would call that content but let me I want to open your mind a little bit and think about everything that you put out on social media could be content all right but it's how you position it and I'm not talking about a link to a blog post I'm talking about a status update I'm talking about an image I'm talking about the words that you have on an image I'm talking about the hashtags that you're using all of that is content and why is that important because if you are using content to attract people to you all right then you're going to think about your images you're going to think about your post you're going to think about your status updates completely differently you're not only going to think about the big blog post that's going to be there forever all right and what I want to say about that is that you should still be doing your evergreen evergreen what I call those type of posts that are going to be there forever and even 10 years after you know somebody may be googling how to because I, I remember this and I'm actually going to talk about it Friday moms and being pregnant and um um running your business all right but I remember a few years ago or was it when Abigail was when I was pregnant with Abigail our second daughter I wrote a blog post about you know how to build your business after giving birth all right now let's imagine you know there's a, a, a young lady who for 15 years from now okay is searching the internet and she's just started her business 15 years from now she's just started her business just had her first baby and is trying to figure this out and she goes into Google and Google's how to run your business after giving birth and bam up shows my blog post all right because that's what the internet is going to do for you all right when you have these evergreen pieces of content that are out there and what did I just demonstrate to you exactly how people are going to be attracted to you if you are sharing information about exactly what people want so today what I am sharing with you is how are people going to be attracted to you through your content okay the content that you put out there you need to really know who your prospect is I am talking to mothers I'm talking to mothers of different stages and even writing about it during my journey that's what I'm doing because I am literally being a mother at every minute of the day while we are running this business and therefore I am sharing that information with current mothers and future mothers to come all right so that is what's important there that your content has to relate to who it is that you're really speaking to who it is that you're really targeting all right and if you don't know that right um, that is one of the first things that they talk about in attraction marketing formula all right but your content has to speak to them it has to get into the mind of them I really really want to get prospects into my business how do I do that attraction marketing formula and the type of content that you write so if you are a jewelry person you know and I always love this example because very early on I remember um, the jewelry businesses they started using this attraction marketing F these types of principles and what did they do they put out content and you know what was one of the first things that you know if you're getting married one of the first things that the woman goes to see is what is the carrot what size is a carrot and all of these things ring sizes colors and all of that that's information so the jewelry business realized that this is the type of information that our ideal customer wants so let's give it to them for free 
let's give it to them for free they they're going to be able to search online and we're going to be able to rank our content and they're going to find our content and be able to say oh this is good information and they're going to come back and get more information and more information and then what's going to happen is they eventually purchase the ring that they want from the person who's been giving them the information and that's what your content has to be your content has to be providing the information that your potential customers want so that when they're ready to buy they'll buy from you all right so that is you know in a nutshell the content your content has to be the driving force that's going to bring people it your content and what you put out there is literally what attracts people to you and whether that be in a status update an image post a blog post or a video those that is what's going to bring people to you all right so i hope you got great value from this don't forget to share like the page follow me on periscope follow me on twitter as well hillary the marketing mom over on facebook hillary the marketing mom as well you could go find it that way as well but it's not um the at symbol is completely different anyway so have a great day and i will see you tomorrow 12 30 or 12 33 12 31 as we have to um set up some new technology here as we simulcast over on periscope and facebook okay so don't forget if you want to dive into attraction marketing formula just click on the link in the description it's either above or below depending on what channel you're um, watching on but it's hillary defratus.com forward slash a attraction m marketing f formula all right amf have a great day and i'll see you tomorrow bye everybody